Hello everybody, this is Dr. Cole. Sunday night, September 12th, heading into week 5 of Con Law, Political Science 3753 for the fall term. Everyone on the syllabus this week, we're continuing with executive power. We're looking at the class notes for lectures 7 and 8. Continuing with executive power, and you'll find that the material in lecture 7 and 8 deal, deals largely with the president's power in foreign policy and war making. But as you get into the class notes for lecture eight, it's largely dealing with the issues that have arisen in the post-World War II period. So that's what's on the syllabus for this week. We have a quiz coming up Tuesday, and you've been asked to look at two Supreme Court cases related to these executive power issues in wartime and with regard to foreign policy and war making uh, for Tuesday. Those are the Korematsu case and the so-called steel seizure case. Youngstown Tube and Sheet, I believe it's called, versus Sawyer, more often known as the steel seizure case. So the Korematsu case and the steel seizure case, they're back to back in your textbook. You have excerpts from both of these decisions, three opinions each, I believe. Okay, so be sure to read all those opinions carefully be sure you understand what's being argued, what's being claimed, and you'll have 10 true false items, five on each of those cases for the quiz on Tuesday, which will be our, let's see, that will be quiz number two coming up on Tuesday. Then after that, we have to get in one more discussion and one more quiz before the midterm exam coming up after the first of the month. But we will be doing quiz number two on Tuesday, so please look at the excerpts from the Korematsu case and the steel seizure case from your textbook and be ready for 10 true false items on those two cases and the excerpts from the opinions that are in your text. Look at all those opinions and be sure you understand the argument of each of them and you should do fine. So we're continuing on executive power this week and uh, so uh, be looking at that material especially for your quiz on Tuesday. Good luck. And we'll be talking to you once again a week from now at this time.